All right, now you guys have been asking me whether there is any enhancements or any new features on Samsung DeX on One UI 8.5. So here is a video about the all new DeX. Samsung did add a couple of new features. We have got three brand new features on Samsung DeX and they are going to be very useful. So without wasting any time, let's dive right into the video. The first new feature Samsung has added is recording the screen on the DeX mode. Earlier, we could take a screenshot on DeX mode and now on One UI 8.5, we will be able to record the screen in the actual aspect ratio, which is usually 16 by 9, right on your monitor. When you open the quick toggle, you will be able to see screen recorder option. When you tap on that, you will be greeted with two options, full screen recording or partial screen recording. You can record the entire screen or you can adjust the window and focus on a specific area and hit record to start recording. Maybe some of you guys would love to use this feature. Drop a comment and let me know what you think about this. The second feature Samsung has added on Samsung DeX on the One UI 8.5 is multiple desktops. Yes, we can now have multiple desktops on the monitor and there is a limit. We can have up to four desktops, which is I think good enough you can open multiple windows on a specific desktop and it will just remain there you can tap on the hamburger menu at the bottom left to open the desktops or you can swipe up on your phone's touchpad using three fingers it will quickly open the desktops this may be a much needed feature for some of you out there for multitasking having different windows open on different desktops having different applications open so definitely it's a welcome new feature the third feature is command plus arrows to move windows we now have a brand new toggle under connected devices. You can go to settings, connected devices and tap on Samsung DeX. You will see this brand new toggle called command plus arrows to move windows. What this does is, let's say if you have a window open on the monitor, you can press and hold on the command, which is nothing but the windows button and use the arrow keys to move these windows from left to right or right to left. Look at this. I will just open one application. It opens up in a window and then I press and hold on the windows key and right arrow. The app window will go to the right and I'll open another application. And then again, I do the same thing, but this time the left arrow, the window will go and sit on the left hand side. So this feature is going to be very useful for multitasking. Moving the windows from left to right is quite easy using the command and arrow keys. Apart from this, we do have some enhancements. Let's say if we open a specific application in a specific location on the monitor and you close it, the next time you open that application, it will open in the same location and in the same size. So we will be able to keep the same window size the next time we open the applications. That's fantastic. And now we also have an option to switch to mirroring right there on the quick panel. I don't remember whether this feature existed before or not. When you open the quick panel, if you're connected to a monitor you will see switch to mirroring option when you tap on that the dex mode will switch to mirroring these are some amazing features which samsung has added on one ui 8.5's dex feature recently they did enhance it with another feature where we could add the widgets on the desktop which is quite useful we can now add any widgets that we want right on the desktop which look beautiful as you can see this monitor here you can add the widgets and organize them for quick information now samsung dex is an incredible feature you can use the phone as your full-fledged computer if you have a monitor a keyboard and a mouse it just works seamlessly i have connected a wireless bluetooth keyboard and a wireless bluetooth mouse onto this monitor and i have connected phone to the monitor through a usb cable i don't prefer using the wireless decks because the resolution sometimes goes bad and there will be a slight lag so always use the wired decks and just connect your keyboard and your mouse it will give you a pc experience the applications run smoothly YouTube looks beautiful on the bigger screen. Gemini look fantastic. You can use any applications that you want on this bigger screen. So basically a PC in your hand. I think you guys should explore this option. If you are someone who don't use the PC or laptop, just get a monitor, get a keyboard and mouse and you have a personal computer in your house. Amazing, isn't it? This is Samsung Dex for you guys. Thanks for watching. If you find this video informative, hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. You get to learn a lot about your Galaxy phones, Android phones. I keep posting update related videos, some new features, Google applications, and a lot more tech related videos you will get to see on the channel. So what are you waiting for? Subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. Cheers, bye-bye.